Hi, I'm Dr. Pamela Abbott and I am the Program Coordinator for the Masters in Information Systems. I suppose it's difficult for people to understand what we mean by information systems. The fact is that they're so pervasive, they're everywhere in our societies and in our working lives that we sometimes forget them. But information systems provide us with a lot of the functions that we need to organize our daily lives. In almost every transaction that we do, even those that are social in nature, like talking to our friends on social media, we are using information systems. Many of the activities that we do in daily lives require information systems, and quite a lot of them are computerized. Also, there has been a lot of convergence between information and communication technologies over the years, and that has allowed us new ways of producing content and consuming that content and publishing ourselves to wider audiences than ever before. The world is a lot more connected than it used to be. In information systems, we aim to bridge that gap between information and communication technologies and how they are used in societies and in organizations to organize our work lives and so on. In this course, what we will do is we will open up that black box of technology and allow you to see underneath, to see how these technology artifacts are developed and designed, while at the same time we will be showing you how they affect the lives of people in organizations and in society. So as a student, you would get a balanced view of both the technical, and the social and organizational aspects. Because we teach both technical and social aspects, our course is delivered jointly by the computer science department on the one hand and the information school on the other hand. So the computer science department delivers more of the technical content. For example, we have courses in cloud computing, computer security, database design, advanced programming, which might be more useful for a technical person. On the other hand, we also have subjects which follow more of a business stream, such as e-commerce and information systems in organizations and change management. So there is that nice balance between the technical on the one hand and the organizational on the other. We don't expect students, however, to have any knowledge of technical computer type programming before they come into the course. We're assuming zero technical knowledge. Uh, so that means that people can come into this program from any background. On completing this course, you will be able to do uh, jobs such as IT consulting, uh, entrepreneurship, business analysis, systems analysis, uh, those kinds of activities that allow you to bridge that gap between the technical and the social or organizational. You will also learn transferable skills and specialist skills and be exposed to state-of-the-art research in information systems.